How about adding a watermark to your Word document or even create your own? Arlene here. Welcome to Burn to Learn. Let's start doing so by going up to the design menu and click the watermark button. Here are some pre-created watermark phrases such as confidential, do not copy, we'll click confidential one. And as you can see, this watermark has been placed behind our document. But what if we want to create our own? We'll show you how to do so. We'll undo this one and click the watermark button again. This time we'll select the custom watermark option. And let's say we want to add a picture as our watermark. Select the picture watermark option to enable the picture selection. Click on it and go ahead and choose your pic either from your computer files or even social media accounts. We'll browse from our files and select Mr. Bernie. You can also select the scale or, in other words, the size you want for your image. Let's say 100%. The wash out function gives the image a fainted color look. We'll uncheck it and click OK. And there it is. It covers not only the current page, but the rest of the document also. Should we create a text watermark as well? Let's do it! Why don't you please subscribe to our channel and leave a comment? Click the watermark button and custom watermark once again. And this time select text watermark. Here you have a few options to personalize your watermark with, such as language, text, font. Let's type what the text of our watermark will be. Burn to learn. By clicking the apply button, you're able to see a preview of it. Let's change her font and the color too and uncheck the semi-transparent box and click OK. And there our personalized text watermark is shown throughout the document. Now you know not only how to add, but how to create a personal watermark to seal your Word document. <music>